Hi, I'm Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and I'm executive producer of Black Patriots on History. Black Patriots is about the efforts and all of the actions of uh, black Americans that contributed to the success of the Revolutionary War. We would never have been able to win the Revolutionary War if it were not for the contributions of African Americans and Native Americans. And that wasn't always uh, something that was pointed out in, in the history books that I had to deal with in the 50s and 60s. I think the Revolutionary War period is important because it is the emergence of America. White Americans wanted freedom from the British government. Black Americans wanted freedom from white Americans and uh, the ability to live their own lives without having to be enslaved. We all had the same idea of uh, what we wanted, but uh, the form that that took uh, depended on uh, what camp that you sat in. The documentary will focus on people like Crispus Attucks, Phyllis Wheatley, James Armstead Lafayette, Mumbet, and uh, other people who made it impossible for us to forget that uh, black Americans were a significant aspect of the effort that ended up in uh, the creation of the United States of America. You can't ignore that, yet it doesn't get the attention in history books that it should get. Uh, and again, we have the rationale that uh, we don't want to make black people feel too crucial in, in the effort to establish the United States because then uh, it, it really points to the irony of how black Americans were treated uh, after the Revolutionary War ended. I was a history major when I attended UCLA, so I've always been interested in history and just finding out so many issues and incidents that uh, you know I should have been taught in elementary school. Our contributions are marginalized. Why is it that if black people were so crucial in contributing to what makes America great and the establishment of the country, why have they been treated so poorly in all aspects of life? This is a very valid question and uh, it makes a lot of people uncomfortable. I had to figure out the why I was motivated. Uh, I was eight years old when Emmett Till was murdered. And I asked my parents, you know, what was that all about? It was, it was horrible and I, I couldn't understand it. And my parents really didn't have the words to get into what it was all about. You know, they, my parents didn't have that. Finally, uh, I was 13 years old and I read uh, The Fire next time. And that enabled me to really get an understanding and I will forever be in debt to James Baldwin uh, for his brilliant and courageous writing. It really enabled me to uh, get a grip on it and uh, proceed to uh, educate myself and uh, figure out how to change things. I wrote it really so that uh, black kids could understand that this is their country and they need to qualify themselves to, to make it a better place. And they can do that uh, because knowledge is power. And once they have this knowledge, they have the power to change things.